it's Jen Sita, and I'm here in the lovely Vegas. And we are looking for C2. Only at Treasure Island. Call 800 1999 for tickets or information. They're here somewhere. I know it. Starbucks, let's go find Taylor. Here at TI, looking for T2. Where are they? Where are they? There's more cowboys. They're everywhere. They're, cowboys are. They're probably playing at one of these machines. Hey guys. Hi. It's Adam and Jen, Adam and Jensita here uh, from Vegas. We are going to be video blogging all weekend for you guys to join in the fun. It's going to be a joyous occasion. I'm looking for T2. They're but I'm, I'm not a stalker. She's a stalker. <laughs> stalker. So, uh, T2, if you guys are watching... Look, there is a gondola. T2, if you guys are watching, avoid this person. I love you. Avoid her. She's dangerous. Alright? Just letting you know. So I'm just driving along right now with Jensita and I'm, I'm baffled. I'm, I'm awestruck right now. We just were at MGM. I dropped off Jensita because I had to go to class. I go to school at UNLV, and I dropped her off at MGM for a couple hours so she could uh, go go hunting for celebrities. And she's all story short. Basically, I show up and I'm like, dude, I am hungry. Um, so we go to the food court at MGM and we were just. Chow chowing down on McDonald's <laughs> and sure enough like throughout this whole vlog we've been all like let's find T2 let's find T2 so as we're chowing down on McDonald's of all things in the food court Kiefer from Thompson Square shows up and he's like down in a hot dog and might I like, interject here and just say that I'm like we're sitting like way across from the room and I'm like that looks like Kiefer like you know he was wearing the whole the whole hat thing that he wears in this album cover. Not that exact one per se, but he was wearing it. And I'm like, that really looks like Kiefer. And Mr. Negative Nancy over here. No, 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 it's not negative. I'm like, so you think that's him? I'm like, I'll go up and talk to him. I'll be like, hey, yeah, are you guys? he was like, I was just like, hey. No, he is not eating in the food court right now by himself. I'm sure the ACA talk them and give them free meals. And I'm just like, I really think that's Kiefer. Like, you know, I so in all my kindness, I volunteer and I'm like, look, I'll go up to him and I'll be like, hey, are you that dude from Thompson Square? And uh, finally, like, he gets up to throw away his garbage at the trash can. We weren't staring at him, by the way, the whole time. We weren't, like, walking around trying to see if it was him. Okay, we were absolutely trying to figure out if it was him. And he kept looking at us awkwardly, <laughs> like, who are these people? And so, so finally, he gets up and Jensita's all like, she's like, hey <laughs> and he's like oh hey how you doing and he was like totally cool and we got to take pictures with him and he signed a signed a copy of the album cover for Gen Cita and stuff and that was like really cool it's like, actually I'm not cool me. I'm giving it away if you follow my fan account for them at T2 Fanatics and you have to be following at Thompson Square as well hey and he took pictures and I was like do you remember my name? And he's like, yeah, Jensita, I haven't seen you in a while. But Shauna wasn't with him, and I was really sad because she's not feeling well right now. But they said that they might be, um, they, they're not leaving the hotel, and they'll probably be, like, at the bars later tonight. So we're going to go back and hopefully see Shauna because I really want to see Shauna. Yeah, I want to see her, too. And you know what I'm really excited about, Adam? What? Like, this whole video blog, I just was feeling like, oh, we're going to video blog, and it's going to have no real purpose. Like, the Taylor Swift video... We were on our way to see Taylor, you know, oh, a uh, Taylor song's playing in McDonald's, that's a sign. And the whole time I'm like, okay, we're really not gonna run into Thompson Square, but it's like wishful thinking, you know what I mean? And we did! This vlog now has a purpose, and it has an end result. And it was completely random, like it was in the food court. It wasn't in like some expensive steakhouse where you would expect some Grammy nominees to be hanging out, eating dinner. Like, we saw them, or we saw him in the food court downing a Nathan's hot dog. <laughs> like, it's the coolest thing ever. He's like a real dude. And he was, he was a cool guy. I gotta give him props on that. Like, he was just a cool dude. He wasn't all like, oh, let me stick my nose up at you because I've got like two Grammy nominations. Are you he gonna was like, listen to their music now? 
Uh, maybe. I've he, never heard of Thompson Square. He, he is. He is. Don't worry, Shauna and Kiefer. He will be a T2 fanatic. T2 fanatic. Hang on, we're going around a tight curve right here and I'm driving. We so. love you and we hopefully will run into Shauna later. Okay. Am I scaring you yet? Am Bye. I scaring you? Am I scaring you? So we got to run into Thompson Square and this is us talking to him. Hi! And I'm gonna make a video. I'm gonna make a video, um, a video vlog if you wanna watch it later. Okay. Hi guys! It's Adam and Jensita. Hey, what's up everyone? And we just um, ran into Thompson Square again. Yes, we ran into them again. Um, only both of them this time, and Shauna is probably the nicest person I've ever met. Oh my gosh. And she's so beautiful. That too. She is like strikingly gorgeous. Well, we just like walked into the hotel, and they were just like sitting there with their friends eating. And we didn't want to like go into a so we just waited a little bit until they were done. We were hanging out. That we seems like the classier you know. thing to do, right? Yeah, not interrupting their, uh, well, they're sitting at this restaurant and bar and whatever it was, you know, that you don't want to interrupt. And hopefully they'll be playing um, somewhere in Vegas soon. Yeah, hopefully at the Hard Rock. I I'm working on uh, getting them booked. I just talked to them about it, and they gave me some contact info, and not for themselves, but for, you know, their booking agency. I will and definitely be their fan girl. Well, I got to talk to Shauna for like quite a while and it was like the most amazing conversation ever because she's so nice and even her talking voice is beautiful. Sorry, fangirling. Okay, so anyways, it was just really sweet to be able to like have a real like down to earth conversation with her and just tell her like about like how much her music means to me and like how I relate to it as a person and like you know how it applies to my life and the fact that this hasn't listened yet. I know, she definitely called me out right in front of Shauna and Kiefer. They're like, oh yeah, he hasn't ever listened to any of your music yet. <laughs> well, she, they saw the tweet from Lucky number A earlier saying, um, Adam, Jensita, before you leave Vegas, you need to make sure Adam listens to a Thompson Square song because he's never listened to their music yet. And Shauna had actually seen that earlier and he's like, oh, so he's the one. Oh, so that's cool. I didn't even pick up on that conversation. That means she like knew who I was before I even got there. That's awesome. Yes. So we love you guys and thank you for taking the time out of your night. We're sorry if we interrupted anything. You were looking very classy, Kiefer, without your hat. With so anyways, uh, good luck at the ACAs and I'll and at be the Grammys when they come up. Congrats on those two yes. Grammy awards or nominations. I mean, that's pretty sweet. You deserve the win. I'll be rooting for you. Please be patient. <laughs> We'd like to thank God for blessing our lives like I can't even explain to you. Our parents, Betty and Carolyn, our family at Stony Creek Records, Greg Roswald at WME, Sean Pennington, Wes Edwards for making a great video for us. Oh my gosh, and the fans, we love you guys.
Adam and Jensita, and we just got done with the ACAs. It was a lot of fun. We got here around 3.30 and we went to the red carpet. We saw Shauna and Kiefer there and Carrie Underwood. Um, as we were going inside to go to towards our, awful our seats, seats, they weren't that bad. Okay, they were okay seats. Like level one seats. These people were just like, hey, is it just you two? And we're like, yes. And they're like, here's two free floor seats. Like, we were just going to give them away. F-R-E-E, -E, that spells free. Yeah, so we ended up sitting in floor A, row K, yeah, seat row 12 K. and 13. 13. And, okay. And Jen Cita sitting in seat 13 became a very lucky thing. There were a lot of 13s tonight, mind you. It cheering for people and when they would announce like who's up for our single of the year and they announce like Blake Shelton and they play the little thing and the next person every time they would say like Thompson Square like I just scream bloody murder and, and then, then the people behind us were screaming and I'm like we got like a whole team of Gen Cetas <laughs> like in the audience here I'm like who even knows who Thompson Square is but like I heard I heard the guy behind me say Thompson Square and I was just like wait what what and he was like saying something and I'm like I can't hear what he's saying like what is he saying and then he was trying to tell me that he was he's Shauna's sister or brother Bro. and I was just like what no way and I couldn't even see where they were sitting the whole time but we did get a picture I got a picture with Scotty McCreary and we both got pictures with Scott Borchetta that was awesome and so then we're just like screaming the whole time and like the rest of the people were screaming and then okay so thompson square we're like who are these people these thompson square fans thompson square won three awards tonight congratulations three, three. no three awards oh I'm, it was three and they started playing are you gonna kiss me or not and i was the only one standing up the whole time i had like these glow bracelets on and i was just like dancing and going I was crazy sitting. and this bracelet that i'm wearing like flung off somewhere and after the performance um this guy behind me it was actually Kiefer's dad <laughs> And he he was like, is this your bracelet? And he was telling me that he was trying to get pictures of them. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Trying to get pictures of them while they were performing, but my arms were going all over the place. And I told him that Adam got lots of good photos and we would send them to them. Yeah, we got to send them all of my good photos. So. Please. And then Kiefer's dad was like, I hate to even ask you, but is this your purse? <laughs> and he hands me my purse. So we took a picture with him and then Shauna's, or Kiefer's sister, yeah, Kiefer's sister uh, was all like, she's all like, wait, you want a picture with me? I'm just his sister. And I'm like, people are going to know who you are too pretty soon. And she's all like, I'm like, you, you need to get used to this. So I became the very first fan to ever take a picture with Kiefer's older sister. I think she was, I think her parents said she was the older sister. And I was the second. So we got Kiefer's sister, mom and dad, and Shauna's brother. Yeah, because... Um, it was funny because they said, oh, you must be big fans of my son and daughter-in-law. <laughs> I was just like laughing. But congratulations, you guys, and we had a blast. Thank you to, for those generous people who gave us the tickets. Yes. And we will hopefully see you soon in Las Vegas again at the Hard Rock Cafe. Thank you. Oh, hi. It was so hard to believe when you smiled and said to me, are you going to kiss me or not? Are we going to 